That thing, holy, what the fuck? <laughs> what the hell? What's up guys, Unboxmator here. Welcome back to another one of my videos. This time I'm playing a game called Quiver. Um, it's in its alpha stage right now. There's a lot of testing, uh, but the developer does seem to be making a lot of updates and improvements on it as it goes. Um, so I haven't tried it out, but I, from what I want, well, what I think I want to do, I don't, do I want to like stash my quip? Oh, nope, that's not what I want to do. Holy shit. Uh -oh. Nope, let's grab that. Um, maybe grab it right here, or should I do it from the back, you think? Let's go ahead and store it on my back. And then we'll go. Oh, shit. Okay. So it, the aim is going to depend on this hand and not, uh, not the front hand, like on hollow point. Okay. Oh, well. Yeah. Let's see. Close the instructions. Now. Okay. Open up the menu and we'll start a new siege. Maybe. If I can figure out how to start a new siege. There we go. All right. And so it's a, like a tower defense. I'm guessing it looked like that had a, an XP bar. Oh, shit. Come on. Oh, shit. There we go. There we go. We got it now. Oh, shit. No. No, no, no. Uh-uh. No, I don't, I don't want you hitting my base. Okay. So, it it's going to take a little bit more getting used to. I think it's going to be a little more accurate than hollow point. I uh, feel a little bit more natural. Oh, shit. Come on. I gotta get you, you're a little too close. I think it's gonna feel a little bit more natural to uh, to use. You can also adjust, you know, where you pull your, your arrows from. Oh my lord, I couldn't hit that guy for nothing. Uh, you get to adjust where you use your arrows from and this, where your, your bow at, or where your, where your arrow is, is gonna be your guiding. Oh shit, come on. Oh! So if you shoot him anywhere but the head, it's a one-shot kill. That's like completely reverse from no 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 shit no that's mine you can't have it okay Whew. so it's completely reverse from like any other first person shooter the ones with the helmet i mean obviously you're shooting off the helmet uh but it's kind of weird that let's see i wonder if the further back you go the more damage it does shit oh my lord Oh, fuck. Shot him in the toe and he died. Oh, wow. It's that close to my back that I can just grab. Oh, no. Are you kidding me? Whew. Okay. So we got to wave five. I wonder how difficult this is going to be. Like, because it's already getting where they're, you know, they're at least making it to my, my base that I'm trying to defend. Come on. There you go. You too. Skeleton buddy? Yeah, get the fuck out of here. So, I do think that this feels a little better or a little more natural than the hollow point one. Uh, there we go. Oh, gotcha. Come on. There you are. And... Oh, no. Shit. Feels a little more natural, a little easier to use. I mean, obviously, there's not as much, like, dipping, ducking, weaving um, as Hollow Point, which is one of the reasons I liked it. Uh, but as far as, like, bow and arrow feels, this feels a lot... What is that thing? Oh, shit! I can't... I can't hit it! Fuck. I'm gonna wait until it gets close, because... No! Come on! That thing... Holy, what the fuck?! <laughs> what the hell? Okay, let's kill these other skeletons. That little stingray just decided to freak the fuck out. Okay, wave eight. We got more stingrays, which are hard as hell to hit. We're gonna try and take these out. Oh, oh, he doesn't have his... We'll kill these guys when they get close. What the hell? What the hell? That took three shots? That one took one. I'm so confused. 
And the ones that are glowing take more hits. Ah, there we go. Oh, did I get that guy? Sweet. So we want to take him out as quick as possible. It seems like there's only three uh, spawn points. Come on. Die, Stingray. You dead? I think you're dead. Ha! Ah! No! No, Stingray! Go! Oh, shit. Oh! Spider! So, for being an alpha, there's a lot of, like, like variety. It seems like this game is a lot further along than a lot of the early access games that they make, that some of the developers make you pay money for. Oh, fuck! Big ass dude! Ah, come on! You no longer have- to oh. Maybe I should be aiming for the head. Oh, this guy's big as fuck! I feel like if he gets close, or if he gets close enough to my my thing, he's just gonna one-shot it. We can't let that happen. Come on! Big beefy bastard! Yeah! We almost got him! To the dome! Get out of here! So yeah, this game feels a lot further along than a lot of the, the early access games that you actually have to pay for. And this one, the developers offering it as a uh, a free playable demo to to try and work out some of the bugs so that he can offer like the the best experience possible when he actually releases it. Which I do like. I I like the fact that he's letting people play it so that he can get that feedback before. Oh, my arm hurts before actually making people pay money for it. I think it's going to be good, for, like, it's a good business move in the long run. Um, because then people are playing it, and if it's, you know, this far along already, it, I mean, obviously it's more fun than if it had just started. What is that thing? Looks like a pixie pig. Piece of shit. Come on. Ah! But, it's... They're gonna have a lot more fun if it's this far along, and especially if they get to try it for free before. Oh, that looks like a World of Warcraft orc! I killed his ass. Alright. But yeah, like I was saying before, got distracted. If it's fun when they're trying it in the demo, obviously it's gonna look good for the, for the full version of the game. Um, better than them paying for it and getting bad reviews, um, and then it's starting off with, you know, next to no hype. No one wanting to even tr give it a try, uh, which I have seen happen a couple times. And so I think the way he's going about his release is very smart because this way you get to try it. People, you know, get to experience it. They get to get in there, have some fun without, you know, investing any money right off the bat, and it creates that initial hype. <clears throat> oh, wave 14. Okay. Which, there seems to be a huge variety of uh, enemies already. I know, you know on the Steam store he actually mentioned that uh, it wasn't uh, actually a demo, it was, you know, just the alpha version of the game. Um, but there was, like, Steam didn't have any place to support alpha development, <clears throat> so he offered it as a demo. Let's see... Also, um... Something I was going to mention, but I forgot at the start of the video. I'm now recording in 720p as opposed to uh, 1080. Holy shit, it got really loud. Oh, fuck. Oh, damn it, I need to kill these guys. I'm going to let those guys get close and start chipping away at this big bastard. Because these guys are one hit. That one's actually probably two. Alright, now to work on the big bastard, but I'm recording in 1080 or 720 rather than the 1080 that it was. If you notice on my last few videos, there's been like some stutter and frame drops and lag, um, and I'm not sure why that just started happening, but I decided I would rather record in a little less quality, uh, still good quality, but a little less and get consistent frames and a consistent, a consistent output for you guys. So let's go ahead and kill this guy and try wave 16. Woo. This 
game's gonna make my arm hurt. This one arm is gonna have muscles like no fu no one's fucking business. Spiders take three. Ah! No! No! Oh, I'm getting low. No, no, Stingray, no! Ah, ah, this could be it. Because he's gonna take a few shots as well. And then the spider takes three. No, woo, woo! I got a sliver left. This is our final stand. We gotta kill him early so that they don't bombard me. You have no weapon, but I don't think that really matters. Got you. Come on. No! 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 Woo! What is that thing? We haven't seen him before. It seems like a tank. He's going slow, so I want to get these spiders. Because at least he'll hold up the hold up the spider's progress. If I kill him, then the spiders will start going faster. Ah, come on! Oh my lord! One more shot. That's all I need. Oh well, two more. Okay. Whew. Wave 18. Let's go. So for an alpha, it seems like a very solid experience. I can't wait to see what he adds on. Uh, the last update that he did, he actually added in multiplayer, uh, which is going to be a cool feature once the game actually releases. Uh-oh. This is it? No. Nope, that's it. That's all she wrote. Oh. All right. So got to wave 18. That's not too bad. Uh, but anyways, guys, I'm, I'm going to go ahead and end this video. Uh, I might come back with multiplayer testing. I'm not really sure if it connects with people online or if you have to have friends. I'm assuming it's a, it connects with people online. Um, in which case I might do a little video a little bit later because that's the update he actually just came out with. Or she. I don't... No, actually. Steam video. It's a he. Um, based on the voice. Anyways, guys. I'm going to go ahead and end this video here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Remember to comment, rate, and subscribe. This has been Unbox Mater. Later, guys.